Welcome to a video from thedigitallifestyle.com and in this video we're going to have a look at this uh, new D-Link 16-in-1 USB-C hub with power delivery. So this is, the idea of this is you can plug it into your USB-C laptop or other device that supports USB-C. You've got HDMI, you've got um, a SD card reader, it gets power, you've got USB 3 ports. So let's, so what I'm going to do in this video is I'm going to connect this up to my Surface Go, see what we can do with it and uh, see how well it works. This costs about uh, 42 pounds as well. So uh, a good uh, dock really without going to the sort of the expensive docks that you get from laptop manufacturers. So here's the, the device, you see it's, here's the device as you can see it's nice and small and uh, let me show you what ports it's got. So we've got a single USB-C to plug into your device, uh, two USB-3 full-size ports, Memory cards, that's like a uh, for a micro SD, a full size or the bigger card, the, the medium SD card slot. Uh, on the back here, we've got USB C, I think that's for power, we'll, we'll check, and HDMI as well. So, here I've got a Surface Go, which is USB C. You can charge it from USB C or from the Surface Dock. So, what I'm going to do first is plug this in and uh, we'll try connecting up the power and we'll have a look at some SD cards options as well. Okay, so plug that in there. It's plugged in the power input. Yep, that's. And that's now charging up the surface, I can see that. Okay, so far so good. I should probably take this out because it's getting this cable getting in the way, but no problem charging up like that. Let me just try connecting a monitor to it. So you can see I've connected up a monitor um, using the USB C device. It's a lot easier than trying to connect with uh, get some USB C HDMI adapter. This is nice and simple, plug that in. So what else can we plug into there? Let's uh, stick an SD card in there. I've just plugged the SD card in. That goes very neatly in there. Right, let's plug some other stuff into it to see what else we can try. Let me get a USB uh, hard drive. So a USB drive plugged in there, that's working fine. Um, so now I've got those in. Let, what else can I plug into it? Let's stick an external keyboard and mouse into it. There we go, external wireless keyboard and mouse plugged in, so we've got the SD card, we've got an uh, external hard drive, HDMI, kind of running out of things to plug into this now. Oh, like I said, we, as well, all that, while we're doing that, we can plug the power in to make sure it's charging our device. So there we go, you can see down here it's charging. So the other slot here is for those bigger SD cards, let's stick one of those in as well. So now you can see in here, so I've got two SD cards, I've got two USB devices, USB-C drive, so a USB 3.0 drive, a uh, wireless keyboard and mouse, I've got my power in, I've got HDMI, all through one USB-C uh, port on the Surface Go here. So what this means, it's an excellent dock, so a single point like that, I can just take that out, and when I come back with my device, just plug it back in, and I'm all docked and ready to go. It's also great for travel as well, because you can just stick it in your bag, and if you've got a USB-C device like the Surface uh, go or um, any laptops or whatever then you can just plug this in have it in your bag and you've just kind of got uh, any eventuality covered there uh, 40, 42, 42 quid so on Amazon just keep chuck it in your bag or take it with you if you've got a USB-C device I'd uh, to check that out what I'm going to do now is try and plug it into my Android phone which is USB-C and let's see what that does with it well, first thing I notice is it's charging the phone. Um, let me adjust the camera angle slightly on this. So I'll show you what I see on here. So I plugged it into my Android phone. You can probably just about see the uh, mouse moving there. So I've got the mouse and I've got a keyboard connected. I'm pressing the Windows key there on this keyboard. Well, I've got one of these keyboards connected. It's charging the device and it will see the storage as well. I can see it showing up on there. So the same dot that I was using with the Surface Go, I'm plugged into an Android phone using keyboard and mouse and the power and everything else. So it's a great way of having just one dock that you can use with your phone and your 
and your laptop and tablet and just get everything done so it will work with it if you've got an Android tablet as well. So 42 quid, uh, 6 in 1, little device, plug it into into you and use it into your uh, laptop, tablet or phone as a dock, or chuck it in your bag and use it when you're out and about and you need one of those connectors. Uh, very handy little device and I'm going to continue carrying that around with me. You can see more on the gistlifestyle.com at iStixon on Twitter.